the brand new Sir Meow's Lot backpack, now available at DennisDaily.com. Hello everyone, welcome to another video. Today, we're going to be playing, well, I sh shouldn't really be saying playing, rather we're going to be experiencing Line Rider. You guys know the game Line Rider? It's been around for a very long time. A very, very long time. Like, I remember playing it very easily over a decade ago, and it's still around. She's still kicking, and people are still making videos on it. What it is, is you're this little, like, snow dude. Snow dude? I don't know. You're a dude on a sled, and uh, you draw out the course for the sled man to go through. It's really, really fun and very self-explanatory, but what a lot of people do is they like to make these, like, sequences where they make a course in the game that pairs with music. It'd be a lot easier to just show you as opposed to explaining it. So, here's a little example here. That's the one tiny, it's not the best example. Let me see if I can find something else here. Okay, hold, hold on, hold on. Here we go, what's about to happen here? So as you can see, it like kind of pairs with the music and it's like really satisfying to watch. So we're, we're gonna look at a few more of these just to really get a good idea of it. But then I figured that we try to do this ourselves. And I think it could be really fun because it's probably extremely difficult to do. <laughs> so I don't know, it's probably gonna be terrible, but I'm excited. Here, let's, let's, let's watch a couple more examples. I'm assuming you guys know this song. Look at that, look at the, the synchronization. Wow, honestly, this kind of stuff takes forever. Like, I remember playing Line Rider and you, it, like, you'll see later in the video, but it's, it's really, this stuff may not seem that impressive. It's very, very impressive. This one is called Line Rider Jagged Peak Adventure. Um, if we take a look here, this video was published in 2006. 2006! I remember watching this video, loving it, going like, wow, how did someone create this in Line Rider? This is the greatest thing I've ever seen. I'd be down to watch it. It's only a minute long. Let's just, let's, let's watch it. Just in case, I am gonna mute the music. Uh, I, I don't know if it's copyrighted or not, but that's okay. Rob's probably playing something very great and fitting right now, so it works perfectly. But as you can see, not all lines necessarily have to be something that you ride. A lot of lines can just be decoration, and so this right here, yeah. I mean, I don't know, looking at it now, I can say the drawings themselves aren't anything really to, you know. <laughs> <laughs> Nothing you'd really write home about, but at the same time, you guys will see just how complicated things can be with this game. <laughs> like, I don't know, it takes a lot of time. This is a huge nostalgia throwback for me because I remember, like, e I I'm, I'm remembering, like, the scenes even, just like, like that house right there. I definitely remember that. I've seen this video so many times. Well, what is it? This was published 2006, so even 12 years later, <laughs> it's it's still I still am in love with it. So you can actually just go to linerider.com. It immediately puts you into the game. Looks like everything here is already like man, they've changed a lot about this. It's just fully ready to go, huh? Uh, let's see. Let's just start with a nice little slope, a little ramp and then uh here. See if see if he lands on that. So now if we press I believe we just press play. Okay. And you go, whoop, and hey, nice. Nice little landing there, except for the fact that he fell off of his thingy. We can erase it. <laughs> there we go, okay, cool. Uh, you can also do straight lines. The red ones mean you stick to it, and then a green one means it's just decoration, I think. So say if like we put a tree right here. 
<laughs> I'm really not putting too much effort into this right now. I just want to see if it actually works. Yeah, I just want to see what this looks like whenever I press play. So as you can see, it actually, you can go right through it and it indeed works as you would expect it to. Let's see if I can clean this up slightly. Eh. Ugh, I hate it. I hate it. Ugh, ew, ew. The thing is, if I try to be a perfectionist with everything in this video, this video could very well be hours and hours long. So I'm just going to leave it. Let's see, though. Uh, if he's going down this whole thingy, we gotta try to, you know, synchronize this with something. Um, what can we synchronize it to? Uh... I honestly can't think of anything because anything that I want to synchronize it to is just copywritten and I wouldn't be able to use it in a video. <laughs> um, how about we will synchronize it to a... Uh, we will, we will blindly synchronize it to a, a song of Rob's choosing. So what you can do, Rob, is you can go ahead, use whatever song you want, and, uh, uh, hopefully it'll match to our, <laughs> to our course. I hope I didn't just give you a impossible task. <laughs> I'll try to keep it as simple as possible. We gotta have something with a nice starting huh. And then maybe even a, you know what we could do? Here's something we should do. So he probably will then fall down like that. Let's just work one little thingy at a time. So he goes like this and then huh. That's a little bit too far. Okay, so we know that we can continue on from like this point down here. We should go like this. Okay, that should work now, right? Because, I kinda wish I'd give it more of a loop. Here, we can have it go up at least. Here, let's see how that works. Play, here we go. They go, whoop, and then he's still going, still going. Nope, he fell off of his thing. Okay, that's fine, that's okay. See so guys, it's hard. You gotta you gotta make sure that you do things uh, very, with very, very specifically, very good. You gotta, you know, it's, it's hard. <laughs> it's, you gotta do everything. Everything's very planned out is what I'm trying to say here. Very much so. And then look, we can even have a little bit of loop-de-loop. -loop. Whoa! The only reason I was using red there. Can I not undo? Is there not an undo button? Oh, you can just control Z, that undoes it, okay. So if we go like this, hold on, so this should be. This part's like, this part's always been the hardest. Okay, hold on. Do we have to go up and around? But then it would have to fall down there. I'll just try it. I doubt it's gonna work, but let's see. Okay, here we're gonna be a little bit more zoomed in. And then hopefully he doesn't, he falls right off of it. But you can see his his sled went around perfectly. Okay, maybe more of something like this. Maybe just in case. Here, let's try that. So whenever he goes, and then it kinda, nope, nope, okay. So I see what kind of the problem is. He needs to, he needs to be hitting some sort of bump here to sort of ease him into it a bit. Let's try that. He goes, Wah. and then, Wah. nope, he just, why? He just falls off of his thing. It doesn't even seem like, like too big of a impact. So that's kind of confusing, honestly. There. So he's going, he's going, he's going, he's going, and then, Wah. and, Wah. Oh, he's going. He's okay. Well, there was a bit of a bit of a fall there. Then here we can launch him into that. Will this work? I don't know. I'm telling you guys, this is a lot harder than it looks. There he goes. He's going. He's going. He's going. Oh, dude, <laughs> we did it. We actually got we got a loop de loop. Loop-de-loops loops are hard, but hold on. I it, it didn't seem to work too well. I think it's because he hit something somehow. I'm not 100% sure. Let's try this because you got to make everything very smooth. So he's going and then down here makes his way up there. So where does he? Okay, so where does that disconnect happen? It happens like right here. So let's remove whatever we can see when he's still on his thing and we can place a flag like right here. There we go. So then next time we replay, it saved his velocity and everything like that. <gasps> Ooh, so we could actually have him go through there. A lot of this is just kind of like trial and error. You'll you'll find things that you, you, like things will end up happening that you did not really anticipate at all. So it's like we could have him go through there. That's pretty cool. You know, we can do that. And he's going, he's going, he's going it up on the loop-de-loop -loop through there. Dude, 
but this is pretty good. We're actually making like a proper line rider game. I doubt that it's syncing at all with any sort of music. We'll do that at the end though. We'll have some sort of good final like BAM! And I don't know what music's gonna be put with it, but <laughs> maybe it'll be just as satisfying as the other videos that we've seen. So if we go around like that, nice gradual slope whenever he falls down. This part's gonna be hard, but maybe, just maybe we can pull it off. So he's going, oh, that's so close, it's so close. Like he hits it, but he falls off. So we gotta find a way to somehow like, I don't know, stop him from going so fast maybe? I don't know, I doubt I doubt this is gonna work. So go around like that and go up and up. And no, then he just hits that. Oi, 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 oi. Not even a little bump like that or something. Just to sort of slow him down a bit. I barely know how this game works, by the way. I'm just kind of doing this all based off of memory. Maybe up like this. When you kind of slightly hit the sled, change the velocity a bit. Oh, dude, no. Okay, that seemed really close, though. It seemed like it actually could have done something there. Let's see, let's see, let's see. This is all trial and error, guys. So he hits it, oh no, and then as soon as he hits that, so that actually worked there. He was able to hit that and it was fine. Eh, eh. Okay, so what exactly goes wrong then? So he hits it and then as soon as he, hmm. I'm just gonna try this. I just wanna see what happens. He's probably gonna smash into it, but let's see, so he bumps, oh. Okay, maybe he could actually be going backwards. That could be good. We can we could have him go backwards down a slope here. So he hits it and he goes backwards like this. Okay. Interested, interested to see what happens and oh, okay. Not really too sure what happened there. I think it's because the game reg registered that as reversed. I see. Okay, okay. So I should have had it go this way, this way, this way, this way. Like that, maybe? So he's going, he's going, he's going, bumps it. Oh, oh, nice. It wasn't as smooth as I would have hoped, but it means that it works. That's what I would want. Yeah, let's try that. Okay, this is fun. I really like this game. So, goes around, bumps it goes through it for some reason. That didn't make any sense at all. Maybe up like this? Here, now I'll put a flag closer. All right, right here, there we go. Okay, well, that was a little bit, uh, you know, maybe a little bit more down like that, how about? There, so he goes up and, uh, why is he going through it? Why is he going through it? Oh, is it because I messed up? I think he went through the back side of it. Didn't mean to do that. Oh, perfect, perfect, and then, he hits this and has a nice slope down. Does this work? Hit? Ah, no. What the? <laughs> Maybe more gradual like this? Would that make more sense? It goes up and, oh, okay. Well, <laughs> I need to somehow have that connect smoothly. Does that work now? So he hits it, goes up, and of course that does not work out for him very well at all. Okay, uh, I just need that to connect nicely. There we go. Try that, and he's going backwards, slightly too high, slightly too high. So even more so like that then, hey? Man, okay, okay. Bumps it, backwards, nicely back down, and he goes down this slope, except the slope is too steep, so more that way. <laughs> there, will this work? Bumps it, goes nicely back up, and back down the mountain. And there you go, boom. <laughs> I think you guys might have some idea of what I'm doing right now. <laughs> it's some scary man, it kind of looks like Bart Simpson. <laughs> we, we, can, we can have it be like, uh, some big, some big yeti man, and he's going, blah, blah. And he's going, blah. and then you get eaten by him. There, will that work? That's got to be like the final little, little area there. So he's going, and straight into his mouth. There we go, and bam, perfect. He just gets eaten, and he's stuck right in the teeth there. And now we can just take green and uh, confidently go ahead and finish off. Any other sort of uh, doubts we may have had? Hold on, in terms of look and style. 
there. And then up here, we could make this like a nice actual proper ski slope. So, you know, you got the whole eh, ski village here and stuff. Oh, wow, look at that. I'm doing this very, very quickly just because, you know, in the end, doesn't really matter too too much I'm just trying to show show off to you guys first off this fantastic game and look you could you could have so many little details in here like a little oh hi look a little sign to like says something I'll just make it an arrow you know but you can you can add so much life to this even just with like like I don't know see like you can pretend like that's still some extra that's like maybe another mountain right there that you're going down this is another little area right here. A lot of this is inspired from that, like, that other video I showed you guys earlier, because indeed, that was, like, just, that was one of the first of its kind, where it's like, man, look at all this crazy stuff you can do in Line Rider. Because, I don't know, a lot of this stuff, I don't know, maybe this could be, like, some sort of rock that's part of uh, another mountain or hill that's going up here, but then this part here could be part of some other crazy formation going on you know the possibilities are are very very endless got all these mountains going on with all these these other you know details and whatnot see i don't know i'm just like at this point now like look you can just throw in whatever trees you want that looks terrible but see get some trees going i know this looks really bad i'm sorry i'm sorry it's just eh. just so you get an idea of like you know what you can do with this game there so you see we're in this little ski village we're just going along and you can't even really see what lines he can ride it's more of just like a show at this point but there you go guys and then you get eaten by some big scary man at the end <laughs> There it is guys. There's my line rider course. I'm gonna now go ahead and uh, Play it all the way through start to finish with that synchronized music Rob I know you got something juicy prepared for us ladies and gentlemen. I present to you my complete line rider course Thank you so much for watching and uh, I hope you enjoy <laughs> Oh, oh, oh no! Ah!